Não. O é o é. <risos> Magalaro ako today ng Walking Dead Season 1 And maraming season, I think I think there's 10 So I have 9 more to go Season 1 pa lang yung meron ako Okay, wala pa kasi season 2, 3, 4 and so on and so forth I-download ko pa Pero matagal pa, let's start Shocks, kinakabahan ako Adapt to the choices you make The stories you're how you play Bills naman nun The Walking Dead Alam ko na to I think pangalan ko ata Patrick eh And then Sa police car ako Yan na yun Yan na yun Yan na yun Yan ako yan ako Oh my god I mean Patrick I think hindi ata yung pangalan ko Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Do what? Why do you say that? Do you, you know what do you say? Reckon, um, why, why do you, do you say, say that? that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. Every, Every time. time? Every time. I, I, I can look around. You smoke in the target to the rear view mirror. Wait, do I? I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. Making? Making? You're from making then? You're from making then? Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. Wow. I always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. <gasps> With all due respect. A real shame, that is. Hell, the whole hey, family used to break at your pocket. folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. Any of that seem important to you? All of it. But that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on a sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? Sure. Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. I? Or she married the wrong guy. Nobody <sighs> You'll have to learn to stop worrying about things you can't control. I'm driving this man once. He, he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all Ew. over right where you're sitting. <laughs> and before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I tell him he's got to stop. That's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. So did he do it? They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say so. Watch out! This other time... <laughs> Oh, 
Thank you kasi dami sila sa Out that window. There's a shotgun is over there. Can I take this? Why would he have needed that? Can I take the shotgun? No? Why? Officer? God damn. Officer? Can I take the shotgun? No. Can I take the shotgun? No. Can I take the shotgun? No. Obviously, you're going to pull in your mouth, so you say. Teacups with some bourbon, if I could. Maybe I should just check inside the house through the glass door before wandering out into the neighborhood. Somebody, yell if you can hear me. I wonder if anybody's home. I wonder if anybody's home. Yeah, I wonder too. The bar. I may be able to scroll. Hello, anybody home? Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Hello. I'm not an intruder. One of them. Three new messages. Message one, left at 5.43 p.m. Hey, Sandra, this is Diana. We're still in Savannah. 
Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message to left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message 3, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. I'm guessing patay na siya. I mean, Cynthia. And I'm guessing Clementine is still alive. Daddy? Huh? Hello? You need to be quiet. Come on, my God, can you just stay to the window? Who is this? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. Okay, so Lee, you're not Lee. my daddy. No, I'm not. How old are you? Eight. Eight. And you're all alone? Yes. I don't know where anybody is. How old are you? I'm, uh... 37. Okay. Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm going to hit up find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Let's go. Stay close to me. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? I won't leave you alone. Well, let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. We need help. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown Atlanta, 15 miles back. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you no, help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down oh, to my yeah, family's I'm farm. Fine. It he should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... I'm just some just guy. some guy. Some guy? Yeah. She's alone? Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. 
What do you want to do? I... The monster's coming. We gotta go. Leave, quick. Let's go. For just some guy, it seems like you saved a bunch of lives today. I don't seem to sound silly in a while. Hey, Sean, I'm gonna run on home. My mama's gonna be in a snip. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple of days. We're breaking down the way things as mayor has gone, Lane, but that ain't nothing new. Is this... I wouldn't have made it back without chat. Is this... Uh, well, I'm glad you took them with you, then. Green. You brought a couple L guests. L L something. Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter, then? Oh, not his daughter. He's, well, just some guy who found her alone. Honey, do you know who this man? Is it because yes. I'm black? Yeah, he's being judged. Okay, then. Well, Sherlock Green, the Charlie. Looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. <laughs> yes, it's obviously. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. It hurts like hell. I bet it does. What did you say your name was? It's, it's Lee. Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. Are you over Sherlock? How'd this Green. happen? I made her so green. A car, car accident. accident. That's so. Where are you headed before the car accident? Um, out of I was the getting out of Atlanta. The news says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about on the road. Who are you with, the girl? A police officer. I was officer. with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. <gasps> awful easy. nice of him. I'm an awful nice guy. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. Mm -hmm. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there. Did you go on to Hanafo to live? I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. <laughs> I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is. <laughs> Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. I'm I dead, got man. chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. I don't Me and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Oh. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. If your leg gets yeah, hot or the swelling down. doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, <laughs> that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. It smells like... Manure. Manure? Like when a horse plops? <laughs> Just like that. Plops. But you I'll be with work by the hand. I love you, baby. <laughs> hey, get up. What? Itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <laughs> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're under no offense. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going. Or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Ah, okay. Let's go to Kenny. He seems like an all right dude. Let's go to Hey there, girls. Hey there, girls. 
I have to say. How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just. Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow, but even then, I can't take away the things we, the things Doc went through. Hello. Hey there, uh, Kenny. Need any help? No, I think I got it. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I was on my way out anyway. The timing of all this just happened to be right. Huh, if there ever is a good time for the supposed apocalypse. Well, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh, had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. That's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? They're in Macon. My parents are in Macon, with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. I don't think they're gonna be all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Yeah. I was looking for help in her house. Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did, but you better become a better liar, huh? fast. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in I trouble. Don't, it, it, so whoever you are, keep it to your damn self. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. Oh my god. I've been in. Go! I'll get my gun! <laughs> This is as far as we're going. Why? It's far enough. Look! Hey there! You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. <laughs> Fuck! Stay shut no matter what. I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. We have kids with us. I see one little girl. I don't think you went to the bus. They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. We have to end I mean, this I now. Wish that you could have my dead body. We we'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! Lily, what do we do about this guy? Why Dad, me? it's just a boy. It, it's... Lily, I'll handle this. Put your heart, Dad. You need to calm down. It's either him or your son. I say it's him. Goddamn right. Out on his ass with those things. Everyone, chill the fuck out! Nobody's doing anything. Shut up, Lily! And you, <laughs> shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. Oh, Jesus! Oh, man. 
Nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. Please get in there. I'll what keep an eye on my dad. Get the pills Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything dying. useful. We could be in Let's here see. a while. Did you see that? Sure did. I'm guessing it doesn't land. Be ready to shoot. Guys! Oh man, I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn! Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go now. Wait. I don't know what to do. No. There's a truck over there. Maybe we can find you a weapon. We should keep looking around for weapons. We can do something with that car, I bet. Went for that fellow looking near the front. What was it? There's a pillow over there. That's about as far as I got when it came to supply gear. I might have an idea for it. Take the pillow. Good luck smothering them to death. That's not really what I have in mind. No. Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. See? That was sick! Now let's just be the pillow. And then we can shoot everything. Something gonna be in the park. Lee, get him! Oh my god. Nice! Thanks for having my back. For sure. Awesome. <laughs> Why did you leave that? Dude, where'd your weapon go? Into the nice big sized hole. <laughs> Holy shit. It's cool. Now we've got this. Yeah. Are you two done? <laughs> Ako si Carly, nakaka-stress. Mag-iiwan. Why am I not getting here? Rad. Hello in there. We're here to help. Please just go away. Let's go, guys. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. Please. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. You're hurt. Oh, God. I... I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you, I said go away. I'm bit. But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? Glenn. <laughs> I don't want that. It's not Christian. Please, just leave me. Please go. Oh, Christian, why are we being... What, is what if you turn and follow us back to our group? I know, that was why I was locked away. I can't let this happen to me. You have a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? Give it to me? I can just, you know, end this, and then, and then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. Give it to me, please. This is crazy. Please, step back. It's just two seconds, just one bullet, and I can be with my family, and it'll all be fine. Miss. Back up, please! Wait, oh my god. Whoa! Ah! Oh my god.
Whoa, take it easy. We just want to help. You can't. Miss, just relax now. You need to think this through. We'll find you a doctor. It'll be okay. Let's all just... Oh, no, no, no! Oh, no. Shit! Here they come! Get in! Dog. Dog left. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? Yeah, sure. Let's step <laughs> outside and chill. Yeah. No, the gate up there is closed. Arm. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. <laughs> we can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Get out there and get them. Oh, I need to You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Well fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? I'm Now's not the time. There we go. Holy crap! Run! Man, that was close. Oh no. Shit. We gotta hurry. Oh my god. Doc, come on, baby, time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up right back. Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Plan. When you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. Guys, that door's not locked anymore. Shit. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Stay away from the windows. Hey, Lee. If we don't make it through this, you should know that I think you're a great guy. We will make it through this! Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know! What? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! I should know what? Huh? You said I should know- Shit! Oh, honey! Are you sure? Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Okay, then. Clementine, can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay! would be dead if it weren't for you. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. Uh, She's kind of correct. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. <laughs> me too. 
This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. They're worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. It's not. Oh, no. <laughs> no. So, so, to be continued. Thank you so much for watching for this episode. The next episode, obviously, is going to be the next episode. Tapos na yung laro. Yes, tapos na yung Tapos na But as I, as I said, I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye.